Hey everybody, welcome back. Falcon, Timber, and Snow. Let's get the game going on over here. We have a lot of things to be doing. A lot of things need to happen, especially when it comes to resource management. We're actually really low in timber. Well, we're low in timber to make this happen over here, but that is low because we're out of wood. So we have some wood choppers doing their thing. We also have people building the wall. I mean, we have a lot of things going on right now. So what we're going to do is actually forward time. You could really use some sleep. I'm you know, I'm sorry, dog. That's not going to happen right now, Randall Thor. You're actually supremely fatigued. Did you not sleep overnight? What happened here? Okay, look, dog. It's probably best you do get some sleep then because you are actually really, really tired. So if you don't, you know, if you want, go over there. Forget that task about chopping trees. Even though we need wood, unfortunately, we have to kind of give you some rest because you're completely fatigued, dog. So yeah, go for it. Let's see. How many other wood choppers do we have? Jonathan and that's it, huh? Yeah, Jonathan alone. Oh, Leopold. So Jonathan and Leopold, is that it? That's that's not too bad, I guess. We at least we have two. So this wood needs to come in as soon as possible. He's over here resting in that bed. You cannot walk to your desired target. You're over here sleeping too. Adam, come on, dog. What are you guys sleeping for right now? Oh god damn it. Your fatigue is actually pretty high too. You know, Matt, you you're gonna have to wait. I can't have you doing that right now. Not because I really need you foraging, but because I wanted to drop you off and maybe turn you into a wood chopper meanwhile. Because I think at 300 food we should be fine and... Well, you're the only person that's foraging right now, huh? So maybe that's not the best idea that I think about it. You're the only forager that we have, right? Yeah. Um... Man, I kind of want you wood chopping right now, too. Let's keep an eye on our food over here. We're at 300 right now. Let's turn him into a, a wood chopper as well. And we'll just have him chop independent trees nearby. Okay. Because we need a lot of wood, man. We're just completely out. Four over here that we just dropped off. There's a lot of uh, stumps over here. Let's get these stumps moved out. Maybe they'll give us a little bit of extra wood right now. Any little bit that we could actually get our hands on actually help out. I wonder if actually setting up these fences actually did put us in a bit of a tough spot when it came to the... um. The whole wood situation. I wouldn't be surprised if that's the case too, but, you know, live and learn, I guess. I mean, we have the ama the most amazing fence set up over here. We just don't have anybody to actually use it with. Because we have no herder. This guy's over here still building this shit away. I kind of want him to actually get the wall done as opposed to this, but... Yeah. You know, we have 40 bricks. Okay, here's what we do, dog. You are going to flooring. We were juicing the smooth timber, right? We're going to actually have to have you stop this little building over here. We'll build this shit la afterwards. Right now, what we actually do need... Look at this. We're building over copper and ore, which is something that we kind of do need a lot of. Uh, you must clear out some inventory space. Yeah, go for it, dog. I need you to build the wall. I think that's more important than building this right now. So our stonemasons better be over here making bricks like, you know pronto and we should probably more than likely up the ante over here so we're at 68 maintaining torch now we're gonna do 100 because we have a big wall that we have to build around everything so the more of this we have the better timber we're at 100 let's continue moving this up too because we definitely do need a lot of this stored up now wood choppers doing their thing we have two of my wood choppers asleep that's so bad <laughs> That is so bad. At least we have one person farming, at least two extra wood choppers. You guys are kind of ruining my whole sleeping rotation, by the way. Because now you guys are going to be wide awake in the middle of the day when everybody else is asleep. Or in the middle of the night, I should say. Which is, you know, really annoying. I don't want to mitigate or micromanage your sleeping schedules. It's annoying. Um, let's get this stump out of the way. This wall is just taking its sweet time. We need another builder is a problem, too. But with people falling asleep... Um, you know what? I could afford to remove one of the timber gals over here. I like how we have, like, literally two carpenters that happen to be females. But the timber gals over here are getting kind of tired, too. Man, it's about time everybody goes to sleep, too, huh? Josephine Bell, you are 7 carpenter, and you are level 3. Let's have you turn into a builder, since you're level 3 anyway, Allison. Come over here and give me a hand building this wall. Maybe that'll kind of speed things up a little bit. Wood choppers are coming back from doing their little wood chopping heyday. Yeah, drop it in there. 11, 64, timber. Uh, still so far off. We're out of bricks again. But that is because these guys are putting up the rest of them. I guess they grab a lot of them at once. Hmm. What are you, uh... Oh, you're building the wall over here too. Yeah, go for it. 
<laughs> Did you guys want to just table team it from each side then, hey? That works out for us pretty well. Eight bricks again. Timber at 68. Now for the bricks, we just require stone, right? Oh, we need dirt, but we have a lot of dirt. If we had enough, if we had, like, you know, as equal amount of, um... Well, bricks isn't even a hard thing to keep in stock since we have so much of this. It's just the fact that we just have, we didn't have people working on it the entire time. That's the harder part here. I want to use coal for this fire now. And I'm going to do this because we have six of them and we have a few places we can mine for coal now, apparently. And because we're so low on wood, I think it's probably really silly to keep um, that fire burning in the meantime. So how's this wall coming along? Is it built from here? It is actually... Oh, fuck. <laughs> God damn it. That's fine, you know what? That's fine. This isn't even our permanent wall, man. It's just a, a wall for security issues right now. This over here is um, going to get built at some time, all right? Yes. It's, um, you know... Same level I missed this fucking thing. God damn it. Uh, this whole depth thing just fucks me over, man. I think I am partially blind. People are probably right when they say, Falcon, are you blind? It's probably true. Don't have enough bricks to continue that. Are you guys, um, you know, making bricks over here? Fuck, really slowly as all hell? Come on. So tired. Yeah, I know, all of you guys are tired right now. It's almost time for to sleep, though, don't worry. We'll get you up and running soon. Just I have enough bricks to get this up and running over here. We might as well just set up the... You know, the flooring over here meanwhile. Because we're just kind of waiting on these guys to make some more bricks for us. I guess a second stone forge wouldn't be the worst thing then. No, but I mean multiple people could be working at a stone forge apparently. Because they always kind of circle around it themselves. Yeah. Maybe even a third stone mason at this point. That would probably be even more beneficial. Alright, the sign. I guess we'll... I guess for now, just go back to making this shit. Flooring and... Smooth, yeah. Alright, so meanwhile, the walls aren't up, then you just work on the floor and then... Because I just can't have you waiting around idly while these guys over here just make these um, bricks. It's taking too long. We got 249 food, and that is with no foraging being done. So we've dropped about 50 food without um, an actual forager, so that's not too bad. It's not too bad at all. I mean, at some point we were like at 30, you know, I think it was like 30-something food. That was really scary. I thought we were going to fucking die from now on alone. Could really use some sleep, yeah? Everybody's just fatigued completely, huh? Is it about time we get everybody some sleep, maybe? And just kind of, um, forward through and see what the next day holds ahead of us? Maybe that'll probably make it better for us. I hope so. Um, let's slow down time here a little bit. And start going through the motions here. Leopold, fatigue. You're, you're almost completely rested, though. So are you... You're completely... Yeah, these people are just completely spent. And I'm pretty sure that I have to imagine that the fatigue is actually making them build slower. And thus, we're not really being really beneficial with our time. So here is what we do, then. I am going to probably more than likely cut off from here. And we'll cut back in when everybody's awake again. Or maybe when somebody wakes up. But we're going to just, um... Everybody switch over to sleep based on fatigue. Like these two guys are. So yeah, everybody's mostly tired, so more than likely everybody will keep sleeping. If there's somebody still working though, we'll probably just stick with it. And see what happens, but... I would not hold my breath on that one. So everybody right now, go to sleep if you're tired. I'm sorry I have no proper bedding for everybody just yet. I should be able to have that though, considering... The straw bed doesn't take too much to make. But I would just like to get the beds up and running in here. Once we get this shit up and running, but, you know, we've kind of run into the issue with we want to make this wall because I'm scared of the skeletons now. Skeletons are scary, dude. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. They're scary individuals. We have some people still chopping on trees, right? Yeah, he's chopping on trees. What about you? Coming to sleep? Yep, coming to sleep. Oh, you know what? Who just woke up? One of my people that were asleep. Randall Thor. So he's up and running again, so you know what? We're going to continue going because Randall Thor is still working and we still have, is that... Allison? Yeah, Allison seems to be. She'll probably get some sleep kind of soon, but for now, she is building away. We have 12 bricks stored up and 70 timber. I hope we have enough timber to make this happen, although I doubt it. Let's see how much this is require. I'm not sure how much this drops to timber by. Let's see here. What is your inventory like 14? So it's only two timber per um, tile. That's not too bad. 
And we still have 70 left over. Yeah, you know what? We should probably be able to get the flooring done with her. So I mean, I'm not sure if she'll do it before she has to go to sleep, but at least for now, we should be okay. Now, storage, tools. Uh, we need another tool chest over here. Storage and tools. Is that another person waking up? Yeah, it's another wood chopper. Sweet. Alrighty. So at least they're waking up now, and we have some people collecting wood meanwhile. And yeah, I guess we'll just place you. Just place you over here for now. At this point, we're gonna have to stop making some chests over here because it's, it's about to hit my farming area. And you know, it's getting a little bit too kind of crowded in here. And I'm not a big fan of crowded, to be honest with you. Alrighty, so, yeah, continue building that area, and we're in fast time for sure. You guys over here sleeping it off. Wood chopping away, and wood chopping away. How many tall are we looking at? 35 now? That's not too bad. What I'm going to do is, since everybody's asleep and we're not really going through wood, let's um up your count here. So, let's up to like 14 for now, and we'll do the same with this individual over here. Oops inventory and we'll go up to like 12 as well just because you know we're not necessarily going through timber right now because they're well we are here but we're not making any more timber since it's like my carpenters are asleep so for now just kind of take the time to really do a big wood chopping effort i just hope that we could kind of um stray away from any enemies i don't see anything kind of really scary out here right now not like when we saw those skeletons just kind of hanging out just staring at us in the darkness that was kind of really scary in itself but um, <laughs> that was creepy as all hell. They were just literally standing there staring at us in the dark, just plying their attack. And you know, they almost got us too. Another tree stump over here. Tree stump over this side. Not sure what it is about these guys and tree stumps. The reason why this happens when you do have them do it independently, they don't cut down the entire tree. When you assign them to cut down the tree, they could actually cut down the entire stump too, but... I don't know, I just like doing the whole independent thing because they, they'll they get shit done regardless of which. I don't have to... Because with my mentality, I'll forget to re or assign an area to be kind of um, chopped down and then I'll have my wood chopper just kind of digging around, not doing any work. Alright, night time. I care turned this on, but we're kind of low on fuel, so you know what? You guys better enjoy the fucking darkness because you're not getting any light anytime soon. Sorry. It's just the way it is. 22 timber. She should have a bit of timber on her, though, right? Six only? Um, let's um, up your count, too. Just because um, I need to get this done as soon as possible. Walls are, you know, coming along. They need to hit this point, and then they turn over here. The one on this side still needs a lot of work. We, need, we honestly need our stonemasons to kind of hasten the job over here. I feel like we just don't have... They're not making them fast enough is the problem. I think what could kind of help us out though is we probably start thinking about making some higher level hammers. What would that work out with? Let's see here. So for instance we have the stone hammer, right? What if we wanted solid hammers? We need a level 6 blacksmith. That's the problem right now. We can't even get a level 5 blacksmith. That is the fucking problem right now. Let's see. Um. Oh, let me go to the U options. It's a lot easier this way. So... In terms of our blacksmith, yep, we're level 4 Jonathan. He's going to be the closest one, but he still has work to do on that. Let's jump to Jonathan, as a matter of fact, if we can. He's over here sleeping away. It's so irritating. I just need to get up to level 5. If we get up to level 5, then we can make things happen. I guess we really have to now mine and get some more, I guess, copper ore so he can make some more standard. He's so close to level 5, though. That's the thing. Um, copper ore, we only have one left. I think we're gonna have to definitely have to get some mining done now. So, mine. Let's see, this is copper right here. So, just grab me that one right now. And anything else over here do we spot? I don't want to go too crazy with the mining. I just want to get the few spots that have some ore that we could kind of use right now. Let's see. There's some coal over here. Speaking of which, how's the coal coming along over here? I wish you could turn this shit off like at nighttime. Like, to my knowledge, you can't. I mean, I could be wrong about this, but I can't seem to. Yeah, Stoneforge 
It's it, it lets you choose which one you want to use, but there's no like, hey, turn me off feature right now. Nobody's fucking using me. Um, any more copper ore? Not really. Not really. There's some tin ore. <clears throat> but I'm pretty sure we can't use the, the thin ore just yet, right? Iron ore, copper. We could. What can we make from this one? What can we use the thin one for? I mean, I've seen the thin ore for quite a while, and I just can't figure out what we're going to use that one for. Strong ingot, coal, and solid ingot. Bandage. Are people are waking up now? We don't have enough materials to craft for what? What are you trying to craft? Josephine Bell, what are, you, what are you talking about? Carpenter? Q, what's queued up over here? Empty? You're working on timber. I'm not sure what you're complaining about. Um, let's see. Well... Need some more mining done for sure. There's some coal over here next to our live pen area, which we haven't even used yet. Let's see. Why is this um spilling out over here too? Did I I thought I removed this last time, didn't I? I didn't, huh? Okay, there we go. Perfect. Dig mine. Let's see. We'll do. There's some coal right there, so let's see about grabbing that. Assuming we could even mine the coal. Need a specific type of miner for it, a specific level anyway. Just need more copper. That's the problem right now. If we could get some more copper, we get that level 5 blacksmith. Hmm. Okay, let's do mining through here. See, so hopefully we can find some more. And in the meantime, you're over here still finishing off this area. Can I get any of you to mine right now, or are we 84 wood? I mean, we have a little bit more of X for that now. People are just waking up completely now at midnight to work. That's fine. <laughs> Wake up at this point whenever. Although, Allison's done. Well, good for her. She kind of worked when everybody else is asleep, so I'm not too upset about that. Now, Stonemasons are back to working on bricks, right? Good. Josephine Bell, you're a carpenter. We need some more timber happening, yeah, so you keep working on that for sure. You're farming. Can we get a wood chopper out of the equation now? Like, we have Leopold over here. Do we need him and everybody else? We have Randall Thor, Leopold, and I'm the luck. Alrighty, Alan. Or whoever has a better mining skill. Let's see, you're a one. And Jonathan, you're a one. Randall Thor, you're a three. So Randall Thor. You go over here, and you go mine a little bit for me, my friend, because we need to find some copper ore. Let's see, I don't see any over here. Just coal and the blue kind, which I always never look into what it should be. But there's some copper ore here. Do you want to, you know, grab the copper ore here? Is that above your level? Let's try it out here. Dig. Oh, it's it's there. Can you come over here just to see? I, I would like to know if you could kind of um, get the copper ore here. No, it doesn't seem like he wants to. Oh, there he goes. Sweet. And that's going to be copper. Correct? You have copper on you now? You have two. So it's going to be enough to make one more standard ingot with our alleged blacksmith. Forget who the fuck that even is. 44 bricks now. That's good. That is good. That means we're actually making some... Um, you know what? It, it probably was the fact that they were tired. That's the reason why they were kind of slowing down with their production of things. But now that they're rested, we'll get some more bricks up and running fast. Timber's still have a problem, but this is almost just about leveled in. And then, let's see. We need bricks for this side of the area as well. Okay. We need a... We probably need another extra carpenter. I don't think she could do it by herself right now. Josephine Bell, that is. Allison's asleep right now, so yeah, we definitely need an extra person who is a hand here. Leopold, what's with this swaggiest walk of all time, dog? God damn. Oh, it's because you're supremely um, encumbered. Oh, and you have a knife still because you used to be our, our dude. That's slowing you down quite a bit, huh? Because you're no longer foraging away. Speaking of which, you need to get to foraging, though, because 196, yeah. Okay, go back to foraging, dog. Thank you for helping us with the wood chopping for now. So we're only down to one wood chopper again, so we're going to be kind of running into that issue with wood. But I do feel that now we are in a better spot. Leopold, um, your health's almost back, which is good. You're going to be just looting dead and gathering berries. And you know what? Harvest some wild wheat now, too. 
Not going to be too bad. Okay. Dropping off food over here. Farming. Oh, my farmer's putting in some food. Sweet. I have a stock coming in, and you're still mining away. Now, blacksmith. Oh, our wall's coming in. A little bit. A little by. A little bit, but surely. Now, don't call me surely. We need to... Yeah, standard ingot. We need to make another one of those. So, we have enough for one more. So, let's put this one in view. We need a blacksmith for that. Who is the dude that's about to be our blacksmith? As a matter of fact, we just need to find a really big supply of copper ore if we want to make some more standard ingots. Because, even then, we're going to require a lot of standard ingots for the blacksmith to work. Ah... I'm not sure where to find a stand, uh, a copper ore supply. I guess we just probably continue digging downward all the way. Maybe you'll find more gems in the bottom of the earth. I mean, that would make sense. That's what um, just about every sort of mining game has ever taught me. Now, we're looking for a blacksmith of four. And that is going to be Jonathan, who is now being our wood chopper, My only wood chopper, no less. God damn it. Yeah, you're going to have to kind of um, stop that, dog, because we do definitely need to have you... Get the standard ingots up and running for us. So we'll probably have Allison woodshop when she's up and running. Because Josephine Bell is still over here diligently working away in the timber. Which is almost coming along, honestly. We're not too far off from being completely done with that. You're foraging over here. 270. Oh, we could also turn him into a woodchopper if we need to. Okay, now you made that standard ingot. Did you level up, dog? Oh, I don't think you did. Fucking, are you kidding me? Yep, he's coming back here because he did that and he didn't level up. Oh, 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 Jonathan, you keep breaking... Can I make, like, multiple workshops of something level 10? Like, can't... <laughs> just, I'll make workshops for now and just level you up doing that. Oh, we're out of coal, too, by the way, so this is off. Yeah, wood, it's going to have to come in. So, yeah, you are going back to um, wood cut, wood shutting. Wood shutting, he says. Wood cutting. So, maintain inventory. We're going to take this knife off now. And let's go and turn you into, into the dude that cuts the wood. All right. And then blacksmith here being total dick bag again. Oh boy, this, this this whole thing with the blacksmith is just so irritating as all hell. It totally is. I'm calling an episode here though. I need a hammer to work the I need a hammer to work the workbench. What happened to my stonemasons, man? I guess they've just been working on bricks nonstop. We have 92 of them. So we'll probably get a few stone hammers up and running really soon. Ah, oh, blacksmith, blacksmith, blacksmith. Again, I'm recording this under one set of recordings, so if you guys have been tossing ideas about leveling up the blacksmith for the last few episodes. Realize it's not that I'm ignoring you, I just... It hasn't happened yet. Your The video hasn't gone out live, and you guys haven't made that comment as of right now. So I can't know what you guys are saying. So, you know, just keep that in mind in case you're getting a little bit angry and a little bit antsy. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up, leave a like. The support always does me a lot. Any sort of tips, keep leaving them, believe me. I'll read them once the video goes live. So every tip you do leave, if I haven't picked up on it yet, it's really beneficial. So I really do appreciate that. I will catch you next time.